All right, so here's today's project. I have no idea what year or brand this thing is, but it's an old concrete buggy. Uh, it's got a Wisconsin, let me zoom in on that there. I believe that says BKND. Um, I don't have very high hopes of it running. I got this out of the salvage row at the auction uh, with plans to repower it, but I thought it'd be neat to uh, see if we can get it running. This thing's pretty rough shape. Everything's pretty froze up on it. Uh, but I'm going to see, see if we can get it started. I got my helper here today. All right, so I got the air cleaner apart. And it is in, let me tell you, pristine condition. But, uh, like I said, I don't have real high hopes here. I bought this thing in the salvage row at an online auction, so I never even looked at it. And, uh, I've had it about three months. It's the first I've ever even messed with it. The motor does turn over, believe it or not. So, let's dig into this thing a little further and see what we can figure out. All right, so... Upon further inspection here, this thing has no spark. Um, it does turn over, but I'm getting quite a bit of dust and dirt and who knows what coming out of the spark plug hole. Uh, every linkage is froze on the carburetor. And I don't know if you can see or not, but the fuel cap's all rotted out on top and it's, it's pretty bad looking in there. So at this point, I think we're going to have to take the engine off, get it on the bench where we can actually work on it a little better it's kind of tight to work on it in here and uh i guess we'll go from there but so far we're failing here all right so i got this engine pulled off here let's get it on the bench and get it apart and see what's going on with it all right so i've got this thing on the bench here and uh i uncovered the no spark problem i don't know if you can see these gopros don't zoom very good but the points are actually green on it so uh, they're definitely, that's probably our new spark issue, but we've got bigger issues than that. Um, I don't know if you can see the dirt coming out of the bottom of the tank, but the, I took the fuel cap off and it's actually rotted. Um, it looks like somebody put a newer fuel bowl on it. They might've tried to get it running here not too long ago, but, uh, it's got some kind of, I'm not sure what that is exactly, but. It ain't good. And the carburetor, you'll love this one. It's, uh, again, full of the same stuff. So, all right. So, much to my surprise, I got this thing apart. Uh, you can definitely tell there's some crud in the intake and exhaust ports, especially the exhaust. And I can't get the muffler off, so we'll have to angle that off but otherwise this thing looks pretty decent and it, it was rebuilt at some point i don't know if you can tell or not but that's i guess my own shadow here the top of the piston reads 30 over so somebody has rebuilt this thing at some point and i don't think it's got super high hours since it's just been sitting so i guess we'll hunt down some parts and uh see if we can get this thing put back together and running